Senator Elizabeth Warren stopped in Western Massachusetts today and spent some of her time reflecting on her first year in office. She's talking about issues ranging from higher education to political partisanship. ABC 40's Ray Herschel caught up with her at her first stop in Springfield. Senator Warren spent an hour at her Springfield office where she greeted supporters and constituents in the lobby area on the first floor. She reflected on her first year in the U.S. Senate, frustrated that issues like an immigration bill and ending discrimination for sexual orientation and hiring met so much opposition from the other side. These are powerful, important issues, and the Republicans are out there saying no, no, no. Senator Warren says her top three priorities are making higher education more accessible and affordable, making Social Security safe and secure, and increasing funding for medical and scientific research. We must invest in medical research. We do it for economic reasons. Every dollar of tax money put into the NIH yields $2.23 in immediate business activity. That's jobs. She's also working to help those who live in floodplain areas who have seen insurance premiums skyrocket. This is terrible. So I've got a bill that I've co-sponsored that we're going to get a vote on next week that's going to suspend the new flood maps from going into effect. As for casinos in Massachusetts, including one here in Western Mass, the people's voices, she says, have to be heard. The number one thing for me is that the local towns really get a big say in this. After her stop here at her Springfield office, Senator Warren headed out to Bay State Medical Center and then the University of Massachusetts. There, she talked about her efforts to make college more affordable for students. In Springfield, I'm Ray Herschel, ABC 40. And at 6, Ray talks with students at UMass about their increasing debt that they face as they get ready to graduate and how the senator says...